Okay, well, I was having a moment and then my camera just decided to be like, haha, memory card error. Uh, shit. The car in front of me, they turned on the car and like, it's broad daylight. My car is not tinted. You can see right through and they can see me talking to a camera by myself in the car. I feel like I've been a little too hard on myself and like, I need to realize that I'm a big kid now. I'm okay. I can make it out there in life. I have a job. I might not really enjoy it but i need to realize like that job is okay because um i don't know because i feel like what i like is i like to have control in what i what i'm doing so like before i was working with people and i kind of it like it was stressful but i liked it because some people are stupid and they need to listen to you and when they realize that you're right they're kind of like yeah but you know but then you see it in their face that they know they're wrong and it's just really enjoying to like come across that or like when people need you and they're just like oh Pandora can you help me how do you do this like okay let me teach you let me show you how it's done like I like that even though sometimes I get annoyed by hearing my name Pandora Pandora what what do you want it was stressful but I liked it because it kept me busy but now since I'm working overnight I don't work with people as before I thought you know I don't want to work with people because people are stupid and annoying but yeah now I feel different about it but you know what I need to suck it up because this is my job and I need to do it until I can find something else like yeah I've had people tell me, oh yeah, you should quit your job, you should come work with me, you should come work with me. Or like in a different department and be like, oh you should try to do this, you should tr try to do that, you might like it. I think you'll like it, but I'm conflicted. Because I feel like, yeah sure, I can do that job, I can see myself doing that. But then at the same time, because things are happening that I can't say yet, like, I feel like that's just waste of time to do and that I should just stick to what I'm doing because things are gonna change there's big plans ahead of me that I can't say yet and yeah hopefully fingers crossed it all goes well and like my plan goes to plan what this talk was really about was how I'm being hard on my, my myself can't even speak because yeah I don't know what I'm really worried about because I don't know I just worry um I do that I worry a lot I overthink and I overanalyze things and like some things needs to go like as planned and when one little thing doesn't go to plan and I said like I'm in shock or like that just put me I'm unease and like I feel like my balance has been tipped off even by a little I panic I try to recollect myself but sometimes it just takes me a while, especially depending who said it, what the thing is actually about, and all that crap, and all that stuff. Can I say crap? I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, I have my own car, under my own name, I pay for my car, for my car insurance, and like, I pay for my bills, I pay for my student loans, I have a job, I can actually afford to pay my bills, and like, I don't know what I'm worried about because like I can I go to pay for my car by myself I go to my doctor's appointment sometimes by myself and I schedule my doctor's appointment sometimes if my mom doesn't want to do it for me <laughs> but I feel like I just need to step out of my comfort zone a little bit you know and be like I'm an adult I can do it do this if I can like if I can work with people, well, before, you know, talking to people and stuff and interacting with customers who like understand and don't understand and give you headache and whatnot. Like, if I can deal with that, I can deal with anything because that's practically life, real world. You know, you ha you come across people who are just like, yeah, you're the best, and other people who are just like, how are you here you know I don't know it's confusing I guess but in my head I'm just like blah 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 there's a lot on my mind and I can't, can't stop talking now but I feel like I need to stop because I've been sitting here for like six minutes and I actually need to go grocery shopping but I feel like because my mom's not home from work yet she doesn't need what I need to buy which is her poke which is her food 
Yeah. And I also need to buy myself food for lunch for work and I just don't know what I'm gonna buy and I'm just gonna walk around the store and figure out what I want. And the car in front of me, like their car has been going on and off. But I don't know. I don't know if I can see a person because my glasses aren't that well. They're like across the parking lot but there's no car so I can see them so technically they're in front of me. But yeah. I went to go get my glasses. Not by myself but technically not without my mom or my grandma. I went with Jared and he picked up my glasses because I didn't know which one to get because I did it. I was you know conflicted with my glasses like I didn't like the plastic shiny ones I like like this one this one's metal and it's kind of matte but all the glasses that we saw were shiny and like the ones that were matted didn't look nice so there's that but we finally found one or he found one and I liked it and we got my glasses now I just gotta wait it's been five days I guess and it should come in in like 10 to 14 business days I believe I don't remember but hopefully they get it soon now I gotta go shopping now I gotta decide what I want to eat for oh maybe I want pork chops damn it I forgot my coupons but that's okay because my mom gave me 20 bucks and here I am telling myself I have a job and I can afford to pay my bills but here I also am telling you that I asked my mom for money but it's okay because you know, she sent me to the grocery store to go buy her groceries, so technically, if it goes over 20 bucks, which I'm pretty sure it won't, then I'm also paying for myself and she's paying for her stuff? Sure, let's go with that. So yeah, time to go shopping. Yes. Okay, it's been a long while. It's been two hours now since I last vlogged and how I was talking about what I talked about. But yeah, I saw my co-worker, we ended up talking stories, we chatted, and now we're gonna go out on Saturday. So one week from now, after my doctor's appointment, we're gonna go out for lunch, we're gonna go to Cheesecake Factory, and it's gonna be so much fun! But yeah, and I'm home, I'm gonna make my lunch for tomorrow, slash dinner for tonight, and yeah, hopefully all goes well, hopefully nobody bothers me in the kitchen, because everybody's home now, and yeah, if... I don't vlog anymore this would be the end of the video and I'd like to say thank you for watching even though I just been chatting and ranting uh, was I ranting? I know, I've just been chatting a lot today yeah it's been a while since I posted something and here it is don't know when I'm gonna start editing I don't know when I'm gonna post it but it's here now